my name is Melissa Darden. I'm the granddaughter of Lydia Darden. Um, she was a well-known basket weaver. When I was learning how to make the baskets, I would go to my grandmother and she wouldn't sit there and show you how to do it. You had to ask specific questions. That was her way of showing. She wouldn't tell you how it was done. You'd have to sit there and watch her do it. I'll never forget the first time I actually got all the way up and I needed the hem on the basket, which is this very rim part right here. She's like, you did that? I said, yes, I did. She's like, hmm. She said, you got more Indian in you than I thought. <laughs> But I guess she had to see that I really wanted to do it before she really show, showed me what to do. And when I asked my grandmother, well, how do you know what designs to make? She said, it's all in your head. How do you get the cane all one size? She's like, it's a measuring tape in your eye. I'm like, how do you figure that? And now I know what she means by it's all in your head. It's like when you're making a basket now, you follow your design, you, it just, it flows. You go out and you have to actually select your cane. We'd go different places and it was always along water, ditch banks, that we would find it. You split and peel it, and then you, it's dried, then you split and peel it again, and this is like the second go round of splitting and peeling it. And then you have to split and peel it a third time before you can actually weave with it. Everything comes from nature. Like this right here, it's the perch design, which comes from the perch fish. This one here comes, it's a single weave tray. It comes from the blackbird's eye. And this one is actually, it's a single weave bowl. And on this one, it's rabbit tracks. If you look at the bottom of a rabbit's foot, it's actually in this angle. This one right here, it looks like a very simple design, but I always love this design. And this is a double weave basket. This is essentially four baskets made into one. This one is a muscadine. It's uh, also a double weave. My grandmother always told me that if you take the round fruit from a muscadine vine, it's like a grape, and you put it in the palm of your hand and you squash it, that's where you get this muscadine. When I made baskets, it's almost like I'm in another world, kind of like my sanctuary. It's a lot of work, but it's all work that I enjoy. <laughs>